Good morning fellow disciples. Our devotional today is entitled Deliverance Through Praise. Let us consider the potent weapon of praise as revealed in Psalm 149 verse 6. May the praise of God be in their mouths and a double-edged sword in their hands to inflict vengeance on the nations. This isn't a call to physical violence. It's a powerful declaration of the transformative and liberating power of praise a potent force in spiritual warfare capable of bringing deliverance in profound ways. Before we delve into the verse, let's define deliverance in this context. Deliverance through praise isn't merely a feeling of joy. It's a profound spiritual transformation, a release from the grip of fear, discouragement, and spiritual oppression. It's a transition from a state of spiritual weakness and defeat to one of strength, empowerment, and unwavering faith. It's a healing of the soul, a restoration of hope, and a renewed capacity to overcome challenges and advance God's kingdom. It's freedom from the enemy's influence. It's the empowering presence of God's liberating power. The verse vividly portrays praise as a powerful weapon. May the praise of God be in their mouths and a double-edged sword in their hands. This isn't a literal sword. It's a metaphor of the potent spiritual force of heartfelt worship. Praise, when offered with sincerity and faith, becomes a weapon against the enemy, a force that breaks down strongholds, dismantles oppressive structures, and brings spiritual liberation. It's a declaration of God's sovereignty, a proclamation of his power and a confident assertion of his victory. The phrase double-edged sword emphasizes the multifaceted nature of praise. It cuts through deception and exposes lies, it breaks the chains of spiritual bondage, and it brings healing and restoration. It's a weapon that attacks the enemy on multiple fronts, bringing about spiritual deliverance on both an individual and corporate level. How are we empowered from this verse? This verse empowers us to engage in spiritual warfare not with fear, but with the potent weapon of praise. It reminds us that heartfelt worship is not a passive activity. It's a powerful force capable of bringing about significant change both in our lives and in the world around us. Today, I challenge you to make praise a priority in your life. Set aside dedicated time for worship, allowing the joy of God's presence to fill your heart. When facing challenges, Turn to praise as a weapon against fear and discouragement. Let your praise be a declaration of God's sovereignty, a proclamation of His power, and a confident assertion of His victory in your life. Let us pray. Father God, thank you for the powerful weapon of praise. Empower us to offer heartfelt worship allowing our praise to become a force for spiritual deliverance in our lives and in the world around us. Fill our hearts with your joy and enable us to experience the liberating power of your presence. Amen.